Oh my fucking god, time for a new vlog. How the fuck are we doing today, guys? <clears throat> Sorry. Must be coming down with kind of uh, vaginitis or some shit like that because my throat uh, kind of fucking sucks. Yesterday, we got hammered or fucking snow. It, 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 was, it was horrible. <laughs> You know, a, a lot of people always ask me, why do I hate snow? The reason why I hate fucking snow, don't get me wrong, snow does look actually pretty gorgeous when you first wake up in the morning and you're driving and you basically see a whole bunch of trees covered in white substance. Snow is annoying because it takes up fucking space. And it's just, it's weird. You know, I mean, because it, it's really, it's fucking really weird and shit because... If you guys ever notice, the color of rain doesn't really have a fucking color at all and stuff, you know, it's, I mean, it's not, it's, you know, clear and stuff, it doesn't really, I mean, I guess you can say, yeah, it's, you know, partially white or whatever color it's up against, um, kind of like, you know, the, the fucking sky and the shit is a reflection off fucking oceans, but it's just, it, it's just, it's irritating, it really is, I fucking hate snow, takes up way too much goddamn space, especially in the New England area. It sucks, but that's basically really what it does up here and stuff. Uh, anyways, I went to see fucking uh, Kill Switch Engage uh, last night, along with uh, Shadows Fall. It was actually a pretty good fucking concert. I haven't been to a concert in many, many years, and it was actually pretty enjoyable. Fucking uh, Kill Switch Engage actually had their uh, old Lee Singer back. Uh, Jesse Lynch, Leech, or whatever. I actually show you, show you guys a fucking picture. He actually fucking, uh, the lead singer, uh, Jesse fucking Leech, or, uh, yeah, I think that's how I pronounce his name. He, uh, fucking, um, goddamn, um, what's it called? Help me out here. Fucking, uh, body surfed, uh, to the fucking bar to do a shot of tequila and then body surf. I, that, that picture that I just showed you guys is actually him up on the fucking bar and shit. Uh, it was, uh, it was, you know, pretty good, uh, goddamn show and stuff. But, uh, anyways, like basically said, um, I didn't really do too much today, mainly because I was actually doing some errands and roads were kind of fucking icy. You see, I, I'm not a whore, I, I, I don't classify, classify myself as a horrible driver, it's just, it's annoying because I hate when it snows and rains because I'm not worried about myself, I'm worried about other fucking people on the road and what they do to me. Motherfuckers in the left-hand lane that go 55 or below the, the goddamn speed limit uh, because, you know, they it's snowing out. If you're going to drive slow, get the fuck over to the goddamn slow lane where you will be safe. It just, you know, you're not going to... Either way, it's there's really no way to make it 100% safe fucking proof. There's actually a car accident, like, two towns over uh, from my fucking town in Connecticut and shit. Uh, somebody died yesterday. <laughs> I, I really shouldn't be laughing, and, you know, I don't really mean to laugh, but, uh, yeah. It, and, you know, the person was just on a regular fucking road and just lost control of the vehicle and died on impact. Kind of really sucks, but that goes to show you that you don't have to be just on the highway to get into a car accident. You can be fucking anywhere and shit. Uh, but besides that, as you basically see on the bung board... Uh, should be 90 goddamn 8 prayer, probably most likely either, the eh, fucking, probably Tuesday, well, what, is it, what is tomorrow, tomorrow's Monday, yeah, so probably most likely Tuesday, maybe like a day and a half and shit, uh, fuck, can't really think what else to really have for updates right now, sorry, my mind is kind of somewhere else, uh, and that's basically pretty much about it. Going to be uploading new RuneScape video on my main channel tonight uh, in a few. Uh, probably most likely going to go to God Wars uh, just because I haven't been there in a few and kind of really want to check out um, all the other bosses and stuff. So, well, all the other bosses in Evolution at Cox, that is. Uh, but besides that, should be on RuneScape for a few hours tonight, and yeah. Alright, but tonight, we're going to be talking about no EXP in the wild. And it's actually something I, I think I'm pretty, pretty sure I fucking overlooked. Because we, we definitely really haven't vlogged about this shit. Um, yeah, I, I'm almost certain that I actually overlooked this, uh, goddamn shit. But anyways, basically you go in the wild, um, you kill someone, you don't get EXP. You go to the goddamn staking arena, you don't get EXP. You basically... it's... 
I mean, there's a lot of bosses, or rather, not, not so much bosses, but, um, there's a lot of monsters in Dungeoneering that just do not give you fucking EXP and shit. Um, even though everything you basically kill in Dungeoneering is double EXP as what a normal fucking creature is outside, and, well, it, it's, yeah, it's basically pretty, pretty much goddamn double, I mean, you get a shit ton of goddamn combat EXP in Dungeoneering, that's one of the reasons why... On that one uh, leechy little thing about a platform boss, they actually removed or ch modified it so you don't get any XP because there was people fucking camping there. All they would do is just run around killing skeletons, and uh, they would heal themselves and get like six hundred thousand K EXP an hour in a fucking combat skill. That's um, <laughs> that's a lot. You know, it's it's kind of really funny because. Uh, of all, you know, these fucking things on RuneScape that Jagex has modified over the, the past ages and stuff, um, the past years, rather, I wonder how many people actually get away with a lot of EXP before Jagex really catches on to what the fuck is going on. Like, if you guys remember when RuneCrafting first came out in uh, Dungeoneering, uh, you could just sit there making air runes, making runes, and you would get a fuck ton of EXP. More EXP an hour than what runes, uh, rune spam would give to you. And it just kind of really makes me wonder how many people... Like, the first person that caught on to it and that kept doing it over and over and over and over and over, how much EXP do you think he fucking got and shit? Probably a good amount. Um, but then again, there are people on this game that report anything that is somewhat cheating or rarely report any exploits and stuff. Uh, just because, you know, I mean, technically it is fucking cheating if you really think about it. But then again, it's really not cheating. Uh, you see, in my personal opinion, I don't really classify it as as cheating. I classify it so much as just exploiting something. Because you, you're fucking, you're doing something so easy. You're doing something that it's not meant to be done like that. Like, for example... Making fucking runes and Dungeoneering. To make runes and Dungeoneering, you're supposed to make runes and then fucking use them for teleporting or avenging, you know, basically use them for whatever. Uh, you know, when runecrafting first came out in Dungeoneering, people would just fucking get EXP from it. You're not intent, you're not supposed to just gain fucking EXP and shit. It doesn't work like that. Uh, that's one of the reasons why Jagex gets pissed off and stuff, but yeah. I uh, kind of really overlook the fact that you don't get any EXP in the wild um, from killing people or in stake. I'm pretty sure you don't get any EXP in staking. I'm almost positive because whenever I would fucking kill people, I would not get fucking anything, um, which is, you know, some something kind of strange. Now, when I first started, when I first started making PKing videos back fucking, woo, it's 2008, um, I remember I was 115 combat. And I remember that I, it took me probably, I, I probably made, like, literally, I don't even know how many PKing videos, but it took me a fuck long-ass time to level up one goddamn combat skill so I could basically, you know, level up my combat level. Um, and I, you know, I mean, at the time I wasn't training combat, and I had no intentions to train combat, I was doing all my skilling shit, um, but it's just, it's fascinating. How much RuneScape has really changed ever since Evolution of Cox has basically come out and shit. Um, now, don't don't quote me on this, but something I don't know why, but it's just I'm pretty sure you don't get EXP in World of Warcraft for killing other players. Not sure if this is true or not. Um, I remember a friend was fucking t and my friend isn't online right now who plays World of Warcraft, otherwise I would fucking ask him. Uh, but I'm pr almost positive you do not. Um, I know in fucking Diablo 2, you would not get EXP for killing other players and stuff. It would just be monsters. So, Jagex is really kind of... Well, they are kind of really made it the world of RuneScape. Oh, yeah, or RuneScape of Worlds. Ah, I kind of like World of RuneScape a little better than RuneScape of Worlds, if you think about it. Alright, guys, well, like I basically pretty much said, expect new RuneScape uh, footage uh, uploaded uh, fairly soon and shit. Otherwise, you're gonna be uploading some more shit to my gaming channel. Just kind of really wiped right now and stuff. Kind of really tired. Uh, but otherwise, yeah. Anyways, right now, I'm gonna go to my email address where you have some happy hooba hooba questions from you motherfuckers. Ah!
ask Nightmare, uh, Nightmare Hari to Yahoo.com and to me, you who's because if you do, well, there will never be any more concerts, ever, 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 in a million fucking years, and of course, there will be a fucking revolution, because there just would be, goddammit. Anyways, first, Hooba Hooba question, Ooh. Hey, Nightmare Hari, what is your method for doing prayer? Do you bury the bones or use them on an altar? If you could please tell us your method. Smiley face. Sorry, your name. Uh, Limi Tony. Um, uh, alright. I already said my fucking method multiple times, but I'll fucking keep re-saying it, because I understand people don't watch fucking every single videos and stuff. Uh, for those of you guys that do hear me talk like a broken record, I apologize, but this basically proves my point. Um, actually, somebody in my fucking clan chat, uh, or rather clan in general, uh, asked me if I'm using a gilded altar or not. If I didn't, first of all, I can, could not in a million fucking years be gaining the amount of EXP I'm gaining if I did not use a gilded altar. That's the first fucking, you know, common sense rule right there. Uh, second thing is if you don't use a gilded altar, you're a fucking retard. You, I mean, I, I mean, you're the most retarded fucking person on this game. Um, thirdly, I'm using Infernal Ashes. Why am I using Ashes? Because it's saving me fucking about 10 to 12 mil from Dragon Bones, and it's about 300k EXP an hour, which is not really that fucking bad. The reason why I did not want to use Baby Dragon Bones is because, one, at the fucking time, they were being merchanted. Or rather, not really merchanted, it fucking, I hate using that word, they were, they, they were rising. And I was basically impatient, and I said, fuck this, I'll go and do something, you know, that will cost me five mil more. But hey, you want to know what? I'm getting on iron prayer now in, like, fucking two weeks, rather than fucking a month or five weeks, what, you know, however long it would take. But anyways, yeah, otherwise, guys, if you got anything for me, you can leave a nasty dear little comment. I'll see you happy, motivated motherfuckers tomorrow. Bye!